What's up everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you how to scan your local network using your Mac computer to find all systems and devices connected to your network. So first thing we need to do, we need to open the internet browser and in here we need to go to angryip.org and I'll put link in the description below. And right here we need to download this file. Just click on zip application bundle and then click allow. And then also we need to download Java 8 or later we have to make sure it's installed on our system. Just click on it. And then in here we need to click on latest release JDK and then click allow as well. And then we can go back and we can actually minimize this window. Once the download is complete, we need to run JDK first and then click on continue, continue, agree, and then install. And then type your credentials and then install software and then click on close. And right here you can keep or move to trash. I'm just gonna keep for now. Then right here we need to go back and we need to install angry IP scanner. Just click on it. And in here, just click open. And in here, we need to click on close. So now this is your angry IP scanner. By default, it's going to add a range here. But if your range is something else or different, you can change it to. Or if this is the subnet that you're using at home, now you can just click on start. And now it's going to scan your network for every single IP address. Once the scan is complete, you'll get this message and it's just basically stating it's scanned 254 hosts and it found four live within two open ports. You can click on close here and now right here, if we click on host names, sort by host names. So now you can see everything that's in blue and green, they're live right now and red, there is nothing on them. So you can see right here, this is my switch. Port 80 is open. This is my router. Port 80 and 443 open. Also, I got a ring. And then this is my Mac computer, the one I'm using right now. So pretty much with this software, you can find every host with the host IP address and if there is any ports are open. And this is pretty much it. If this video was helpful to you, press that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.